Thank you, Chair. The ACDP appreciates the respect shown in the handling of the Medical Innovation Bill, a private member's bill which lapsed at the end of the fourth parliament, was revived at the beginning of the fifth parliament, and on the death of MP Ariana Ambrosini, was reintroduced by Honorable Naran Singh. The ACDP would like to acknowledge Dr. Ambrosini's work, especially his constitutional victory, which opened up space in our parliament for taking private members' bills more seriously. We are, however, concerned that legislative actions giving uh, access to marijuana seriously jeopardize consumer protection. Processes for bringing medicine to the public have been established so that science and not emotion prevails. The Medicines and Related Substances Act now provides for a person desiring to initiate or conduct a clinical trial to apply for authorization to do so, and the Department of Health has finalized guidelines on the cultivation and manufacture of cannabis-related pharmaceutical products for medicinal and research purposes to provide minimum operating procedures. According to Dr. Uh, A. van Eden, CEO of Doctors for Life, cannabis is not a safe drug and is far from clearly um, effective. Cannabis activists, he says, allege benefits of marijuana use with, with little or no clear scientific basis. Now, it is also important to remember that smoking any substance causes the smoker to inhale cancer-causing substances. And now you, you might say, why mention this here? Um, well, opening the country to cultivation and manufacture of cannabis products is highly unlikely to reduce access to dope, and entrepreneurial initiatives are likely to flourish, and in fact we know of many that have been waiting in the wings to do so. Cannabis use, which is strongly associated with juvenile crime and plays a significant role in traffic accidents, some of the most consistently identified problems with marijuana use are the effect on memory, concentration, coordination, and reaction time. The effects on driving skills and coordination are extremely serious, and marijuana is regularly implicated in trauma. Cannabis is actually taking over from alcohol as the most common drug involved in motor vehicle accidents in parts of the USA. Now, the implications for accidents in the workplace are therefore obvious, not to mention exam results and learner retention. So the ACDP calls on government to ensure collaboration between departments and the South African Police Services on the commercial suitability of growing cannabis products um, in South Africa takes into consideration the very serious impact on society and departmental budgets like health, budgets like education, budgets so like social development and justice. Thank you. Thank you, Honourable Member.